Hey everyone, today I'm going to talk to you a little bit about how to qualify your short film for an Oscar. The only other way to have a film qualified for the Oscars is if it wins at a film festival that is an Oscar qualifying festival. So if that happens, you don't need to go through this process that I'm going to explain. But if you aren't able to do that, if you're not able to get into a film festival uh, and actually win for that category, then this is another way you can qualify to have your film in the running for an Oscar. So the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is you wanna to go to oscars.org and you wanna find rules and eligibility. This is a really important part of this. Once you're at the rules page, you need to pay very special attention to detail and follow every rule. There are so many submissions, they look for a reason to disqualify people, and so any variance could get you disqualified. So just be very, very careful that you follow every rule to the T. Once you read the rules, make sure your film follows all of the guidelines as far as the output of the film. This is incredibly important. It's got to meet the sound guidelines, it's got to meet the art guidelines, and most importantly, it has to screen in Los Angeles or New York um, for one week. It has to screen three times a day for seven days in order to qualify. Another additional requirement for qualifying is it must be advertised in a local paper that's approved, like the LA Times or LA Weekly. And then there's some other sources you can check as well, but that's an important part of the qualification process. Another thing that will automatically disqualify you is if you market to or reach out to Academy members directly and try and promote your film to them. That is an absolute no-no and they will disqualify you. One thing I highly recommend is that you consider going with um, Lemley Studios here in LA. They actually qualify films for uh, the short film category all the time and they have the process down. So for a fee, they will screen the film the seven days, uh, playing it three times a, a day, and then they also add it to an advertisement that they put in the local papers. So they cover all the bases. They've been doing this for a very long time, so they know how to do it without any hiccups. So I, I highly recommend if you're a filmmaker trying to qualify that you actually contact them and go that route. It's a lot less headache and a lot more peace of mind. If you choose to go with Lemley to qualify your film for an Oscar, what they'll do is they basically put a block of films together, a block of shorts together, and they play them in blocks. And then after the entire process is over, then they'll deliver to you all of the material that you need to return back to the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences. So that's what you should expect. Another plus of this process is you are four-walling the movie. So the theater will return back a portion of the ticket sales to you. So that's something to look forward to. I've submitted several times and our films have qualified. And the really cool thing about that is the Academy will put out a press release that shows which films are in consideration and you can use that to promote with. Um, but what you can't do is you can't use the name Oscar or the Academy or any of their logos in any other kind of marketing unless you were on the short list commonly known as a nominee. So whatever you do, just don't, if you get on the list, uh, just remember that you can't use any of their trademarks or name in any other promotion. I hope this gives you some insight on how to submit your film for Oscar consideration. So again, just go to oscars.org, go to their rules and eligibility and follow them to a T. Good luck in your quest. If you're enjoying these film tips, don't forget to subscribe. You can click here. And if you wanna hear more, keep listening.